<laughs> and then the cat, the cat fell right into the water. Oh, no. <laughs> like you know when flushed. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, well, Sylvia, oh. I gotta be going. Oh. I just wanted to make sure that these were right here in your home before uh, I left. I didn't want to leave them in your mailbox. Oh, thank you. Oh, Blue, we're just going to really enjoy these. And uh, thank you. The homemade cookies are just a really kind gesture. I'll try and save some for Go Bonies. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> it was uh, so nice seeing you again, but can do you, you sure you have to go? Yeah, I gotta go. Blue's gotta go. Blue's gotta get on his way and make some cookies for our neighbors and deliver them before dinner. Okay, well, it was nice seeing you again, so take care, okay? Blue is out of here, cause I'm blue. Blue, blue, blue. Blue, 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 blue. Blue. Sylvia! Hi. Who was that? That was my friend Blue. You remember him from church? Oh yeah, I think I do remember him. He talks funny and he eats weird food. <laughs> and he's blue. Oh, but isn't that great that we're not all the same? It would be a boring world if God made us all the same color and we all ate the same things and talked the same way. Yeah, but my friend Billy, he says we shouldn't trust blue people. Oh, well. That sounds like Billy has a prejudice. A what? A prejudice. That's when we prejudge someone who we've never even met or don't know anything about. And we form opinions about people that aren't even based on actual events or experiences. I'm not sure I understand. Oh, well, we might have a prejudice about where someone comes from, or what they look like, or what they believe in. The problem is, is if we prejudge someone before we get to know them, it makes us blind to what they're really like. Blind? Well, I don't think I understand. What do you mean, blind? Well, do you remember yesterday when you tried on my sunglasses? Oh yeah, I remember. It made everything look really, really green. That's right. And when we came inside, it was dark and you couldn't see properly. Yeah, I almost fell down the stairs. It was so dark, I was like plump, 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 plump down the stairs. So, so then I took off the sunglasses, right? And you could see properly. Yeah, and so our prejudices are like these sunglasses. They keep us, we don't even know we have them on, and they keep us from seeing people the way they really are, from seeing the good things in people. Sylvia, so, you said, are prejudices. Does that mean you have them too? Yeah, I think I think everybody has problems prejudging other people at some point or another. We forget that God made us all unique and he made us, he loves us all and he made us to love each other and he wants us to be kind and good to everyone. And yeah, I think I do have a problem and I need God's help to take off my sunglasses and to see people as they really are. Oh, maybe we should pray and ask God to help us take our sunglasses off so we can see people as they really are, as God sees them. Can we do that? That is a really good idea. Do you want to do that now? Yeah, let's do that right now. Okay, let's do that. Holy God, thank you for making each of us unique. Help us not to be afraid of our differences, but to delight in the ways that we are different. Remind us that we were all created in your image and that we are all loved by you. This week, help us to be loving in our thoughts and actions. And together we say, Amen. Amen. Sylvia? Yes? Even though those cookies are a little bit different, you think we could go try them in the backyard or something? Oh, I like cookies. I think cookies we could. I like cookie, let's cookie, go. Cookie. Let's go to the backyard. Okay, let's go to the backyard and have some cookies. Okay. Bye, everybody. Bye, everybody. Have some cookies. Remember, Jesus loves you no matter what. That's right. <laughs>